What up, y'all? What's good, YouTube? Let's get into it. Make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe if you're new. Mr. Beast just dropped this new video, so y'all know we got to tune in, man. Y'all know we got to tune in. All right, look at that. 19 minutes already, million views. All right, it's going to be a good video. We got a dollar versus $250,000, million private island. Okay, this definitely going to be good. Okay. Hey, I know if anything happened, it's the end of the world. I know who I'm going to call up. I know who I'm going to look for. I'm going to look for Mr. Beast. I ain't going to lie to you. Between him and Elon Musk, I'm going to look for them. <laughs> Just playing. All right, let's get into it, y'all. This is a $250 Ooh. It ain't got a circuit there. Or does it? It'd be far if it does. Ooh. Oh, on this private island. Ah, and I'm wow. going to show you the difference between this and a $150 million luxury island. That's cool, it's a too. massive $45 million island, a $5 million frozen island, all the way down to the world's Ooh. cheapest private island. That thing, I'm starting to realize we might not all fit on it. <laughs> First step on my brand new island. Here's your dollar. Thank you, sir. Thank you for selling it to me. It's yours now, buddy. Let's check out what I just bought. My first impression. Wait. You're buying all of these? Is that what you're telling me right now? I'm not tripping. It's a lot smaller than I thought. When you pay a dollar, you get a random pile of bricks, an old toilet. I found a restroom. And a bunch of random Ew. wooden poles. There's more poles than square feet on this thing. They're actually not <laughs> piling. Let's pile onto that boat and leave. And as you can see, <laughs> there's nothing here. So I'm going to blow it up. Well, later in this video, we're going <laughs> to a $150 million island and also a quarter billion dollar super island. All right. But first, we're going to head over to the $1 million island okay. called Monkey Island. Ooh. Yes, you heard me. Why right. they call it Monkey Island? island is literally swarmed with hundreds of monkeys. <laughs> Look out on there everywhere, like squirrels, but they actually come up to you. The one right there, one right there, one right there. I think I see one up here. I can see why it's called Monkey Island. Right. Oh, what's his monkey? Oh, it's Odie. Oh, oh, oh. We got. Took my orange. He okay. took it. Yeah, he took your orange. He don't even want you. He want the orange. He said, "Give me that." You take the juice. Let me get the actual orange. He like, yeah. Monkey seafood, monkey taste. <laughs> All the monkeys on this island have a strategy for interacting with people. They gaslight you into thinking that you're friends, and then they, they take your food. They're just like the women. <laughs> Literally, they gaslight you, then they steal your food and money. Yes. Hey, I seen the monkeys try to take people with diamonds off their ears and off their neck. Don't let you have some diamonds on you. Yes, they just like the women. If you're wondering where you and your friends are going to sleep on this island, suspended above the water Ooh. are six luxury cabanas, okay. which house both humans and monkeys. Ooh. The monkeys are having the GoPro, Jimmy. We need this for filming. Can they go to sleep in there, too? This, uh, thank you. Okay, I got my camera back. You want to... Oh! Yeah, oh. It's cool. it's your hat. Okay, you, you can have that, sir. By the end of this, I'm going to be naked. The monkeys are stealing everything. They're stealing everything. the monkeys everything. are not even the coolest part of this island. See, this island isn't even Island at all. It's actually on top of a massive underwater plant network that emerged uh -huh. from the sand and water to create this illusion of an island that we see today. Is this a million oh, wow. dollar island or a million dollar bush because there's no land? What do you think? I don't know. Bush. <laughs> I think an island is what you make of it. <laughs> and on the other side of the island... I see what you're saying though. I see how it's a bush, but I can see how they got it. That's crazy. They still made an island. I can see, I can see that. That's, that's amazing. That's amazing. Relaxation area and a beachfront massage parlor. No way. I'm trying not to fall in the water. I'm about to get a massage with a monkey. <laughs> really cool. Notice how all the water around you is freezing. What? Whoa. That took a lot of effort. And we put that much effort in to convey that the $5 million island is very cold. And where we're going next, okay. most of the year looks like this. But it's going to look like this. No joke, this island is so cold right now that the lake around it is actually frozen solid. Uh, Which means to get there, we're going to be using an interesting vehicle. Oh, wow. Yeah, apparently snowmobiles are just too basic for this island. It just had to be hovercrafts. Hey, so fun. And it only took about 30 seconds of being outside the hovercraft for the king to be frozen solid. What is it? It's 7 degrees Celsius. Pretty cold, man. You're like, more like a 70 guy. <laughs> and so they hurried over to these futuristic self-heated huts to stay. Self-heated? Wow. And they look nice. It looks like a spaceship. Space shuttle. Like, they're like a bunk. Ooh, it looks very nice. Boy. Oh, this is so small. Wait, it's so no nice. For you in here. Uh, we're gonna have to cut And these huts are able to stay here completely year round because 
because mm. not only can they float on warm, peaceful lake water, but <gasps> they also do just fine in the dead of winter. But uh, I they, they float on the water too? That's fine, okay. Hey, <laughs> you gonna wake up, you on the other side. Like, hey, baby. Uh, I think we, uh, yeah, we just crossed the border. <laughs> like, 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 nah, it's a flag because you're in the lake, so you ain't gonna go too far. But you're on the other side of the lake. Oh, amazing. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> even though this island comes with a luxury cabin to stay in oh this is beautiful Ooh. fine i'll take it yeah. oh i can't I, I need to see it in the in, in the, the daytime i mean uh in the, in the summertime without the snow because that's beautiful like the whole thing the, you can even see the um the infrastructure you know what i mean and it's, it's really protected you know what I mean? You can just shit is protected more than my house, and they got snow. You feel me? Like, hey, they make a show. And that thing gonna stand up for at least another twenty years. Buy it from so that's really good. They're spending most of their time really on the good. frozen lake, where they were able to ride. Oh, so the lake would be right there. I took a look. They look small. Any island's gonna beat this. Maybe one where I can feel my hands. And Carl's hands are in luck because the next island is not only warm, but more expensive okay. than all of the other islands combined. Okay. Right, this this island is tiny, but arguably one of the most luxurious ones out there. <laughs> okay. uh, that look like somebody else. They're like Taylor Swift house or something. Like she own that. She own that whole thing right there. Sixteen million. That's that's something I would definitely just purchase and be like, "Yep, we're doing two row." <laughs> like, yep, not two row. Y'all get what I'm saying? Airbnb. Anybody need a sixteen million dollar house? You know what I'm saying? Come through. I ain't charge you about a, a, a band a day. You know what I'm saying? But you get you a private island. You got the all the electricity. You got a pool. You got yeah. Let's go check out the house. This Airbnb oh, wow. for sure. <gasps> We're stoked oh, yeah. to have you as our guest. We hope you have a blast. Just don't break anything. Yeah, <laughs> we should try to break one thing. <laughs> Ooh, nice bathroom. Usually, rich people like showers that can fit like thirty to a thousand. Yes. Yes. Some people in them. This yes. time, they chose a reasonable shower. When you pay $16 million, in addition to a shower that's the size of the $1 island, the private island comes with this <laughs> helicopter that's apparently too Ooh. big for the island. <laughs> Jet skis, we have a submarine, another submarine to the right. We have a shark submarine oh, over there. There's almost a submarine. That's fire. Submarine for fire. each of us. Boys, do whatever you want. Have fun. What? I'll be going to the submarine. That looks fire. Ooh, that looks fire too. Oh, 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 and you wasn't going 500 miles per hour. Stupid. <laughs> what? <laughs> Speedboat don't even max out at 500, stupid. <laughs> this man is crazy. <laughs> Any last words? I love you, I'm sorry. This helicopter is taking the boys up into the okay. air and letting them jump and free fall into Ooh, the ocean. Fine. We shouldn't be doing this. This is only a $16 million island and we're jumping out of helicopter. Go, go, go. Hit a backflow. No backflow? Okay. Good job. Okay. Backflow. 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 All right, all right. <laughs> he fell straight down. doesn't buy happiness, doesn't own that private island. I'm pretty he said, whoever said money doesn't buy happiness doesn't own that private island. That makes that makes a lot of sense because they own that, they, they'll they'll definitely be happy. I, I I I understand. I mean, temporarily. After driving the jet skis ten years in a row, eventually I'm like, man, uh, can we can we go to Las Vegas or something? Like, you gonna be like, man, you wanna go somewhere else? I'm pretty sure. Like, yeah. are you gonna want some people to come to you? Forty-five million. Okay. Okay. I did it all in free. Oh hey! Oh, I didn't even realize there were videos. 
I always feel um, uncomfortable when I pull up to places and people are just standing potentially for hours waiting on me. <laughs> right. Is it alcoholic? No, it's not. He's not 21. All of those smoothies look good. Ooh, they got some. They got some. I mean, I need all three. They all look good. Coconuts, everything. I need it all. You guys add them to your round by lining a little bit. Let's see what $45 million gets us. It's a long path. The path is longer than the last iHeart Center. Yeah, it is. 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 Y
Which one y'all take? I gotta take the one on top of the hill. Y'all gotta take. Hey, somebody else gotta take this one. Somebody, my homie gonna take this one, so you can't get this one. So you gotta get the one on this side. Mister B said he he want he want he want this one too. So matter of fact, I'm gonna get that one. He can get that one. And then uh, my homie got that one. So y'all gonna have to take this one. There's one down here and this one over here. You see what I'm saying? We already picking. Like it, you feel me? Like this mega mansions and the like best part is it's completely powered by solar hey, panels and wind turbines. And wind turbines. That's what I said. Solar panels, wind turbines. And if we had enough uh, streaming water, you, we can use the water to turn for electricity. You won't have to worry about electricity. You won't have to worry about Georgia power, nothing. <laughs> you heard me? I live in Georgia, so you won't have to worry about California power, whatever y'all call it. You know what I'm saying? You ain't worry about them coming to turn your power back on. I mean, we got we got enough electricity to last us, um, um, you know what I'm saying, until the end of the planet type. You know what I mean? Like, we already got everything we need. Ooh, flamingos. We don't, we don't even see flamingos unless you're in Miami or something. You're in Florida or something. Ooh, they look beautiful, too. It's home to some of the most exotic animals I've ever seen. Oh. It took over four decades to build. Oh, that means that island has a lot of animals. A lot of animals. Okay. Okay, this is a good one, too. We're going to need some security, though, because some animals, they get too curious. <laughs> you heard what I said? They get too curious. <laughs> They're like, oh, it's a human. He looks a little different, though. <laughs> Start trying to climb on top of you. Like, hold up now. Security. <laughs> This island will literally blow your mind. I when see. I think of a private island, this is what I think of. That's good, because this is a private island. I, wow. And apparently, the first thing you need to do here is wash your hands. Make sure you don't taint the island. Wow, I love it. I love it. I love it. Island with your outside world. Right? I've already washed I my love hands. It. Does everyone who come here get some coconut? I mean, they're not Wait, do y'all stay there? Cause I see that shirt say something about Virgin Islands. Is that where y'all y'all work there or something? Cause I, I mean, even if I can't stay there, then I get a job there. You know what I'm saying? They give me a little room somewhere, man. You know what I'm saying? I catch the vibes out there. I ain't even tripping. You feel me? I ain't tripping. I ain't got to buy the whole island, man. Like, hey, man. <laughs> you, you feel me? Shoot, send me to Hawaii. I ain't tripping off nothing. Give me a job. <laughs> you feel me? Like I'm just trying to see the vibes. You're not running low. <laughs> I don't know if it's because yeah. this place is so <laughs> fancy, or maybe they just heard about Carlos driving. Uh -oh. But each of us ended up with our own personal driver. I have a feeling this is going to be a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Unless he come back. Well, I might be out of my price range. <laughs> and even though this island costs $150 million, you can actually rent it for yourself. For the extremely low price of $140,000 per day. Okay. I didn't even realize you okay. just went up a mountain. <laughs> I've heard this is the most luxurious. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. Okay. I can understand that taking a little vacation for a week, but then again, this is like the movies. They say they the people they take the family on a little vacation. They go on to a little island and they all happy. And then on that island, there's some other family there. Who knows what's going on or whatever? <laughs> it's a <laughs> it's a terrorist. There's some people there that's gonna. Come kidnap your kids or something. You can make a whole movie off this island for real, for real. Cause it's like I could just like I could picture the whole thing in my head, like write it down, man. It's a whole script right there. You feel me? Like I just off of the island in general. And of course, like the budget gonna be, you know, a two, three million dollar budget. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, like he says, it's hundred forty thousand. You know what I'm saying? A day, so we gonna have to shoot the movie quick. You feel me? Like, but it's, it's yeah, that's a great place, man. It's so many vibes, so many different places you can shoot pictures. Like even with the walkway right here, you got some models standing right there with the next. You know what I'm saying? Palm trees, shooting the pictures with the sun in the back and sun in the front. All that good stuff. Got the animals coming around. All the flamingos, man, man, you go crazy out there, man. That's a nice island. This private island in the world. It's, it's a real nice. The island. view is insane. This is the great house. But before we were able to house. explore the great house. Get out, get out of my house. I ain't tell y'all to go to my house. <laughs> you feel me? I ain't tell y'all y'all can go out your plan. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can go to my house, man. Y'all can go check it out, man. I ain't there right now, but y'all can go check it out. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and check it out, man. I own all these houses. I own everything on this damn planet. Everything. Y'all can check it out, though. Y'all can use it for now. You know what I'm saying? I might need it back later, though, but you can check it out for now. <laughs> Friends got distracted by a turtle. There's a turtle? Get in there! Yeah. Oh, he like he like watermelon? Is that watermelon? This island is so extra that for every one person in your party, they have ten staff members <laughs> waiting on your every need. There's a bunch of people over there like, here's drinks, here's food. What do you want to do over the next few days? And well, they they probably haven't seen new fresh faces or people in so long, and that's what I'm saying. Like, you know what I mean? Shoot, they better bring them. Hey, bring them prices down a little bit. You have more people come visit the island. You know what I'm saying? Go to a hundred thousand per day instead of one forty-two. Cause that's kind of a strange number. One forty-two. At least you go to one fifty. 
Don't do no 142. 142 to me sound weird. It's like, what are you? It's like you trying to pull my leg. You know what I mean? Now, if you said 150, it'd be like, okay, 150, two days, uh, 300. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, three days, we're going to be at 450. You know what I mean? I can do the math a little bit better that way. But you're talking about 142. It's like, uh, nah, baby, you want to do something else? It's like you start thinking otherwise. Even Like I said, you could say 150. 150,000 per day. If you went to 100,000, that's even better. But you can go up. You see what I'm saying? Add an extra 8,000. A rich man ain't going to mind spending an extra 8,000. It's just the fact that the number... It's like 142. It's a weird number. It's not even 111. You could have said one, one, uh, 100,000, uh, um, 111, whatever. You could have said the whole number out. You know what I mean? Like, you could have put a little magic to it. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, 142. That's kind of. I mean, I'm gonna give y'all extra. Eight. I'm gonna give you extra eight just because. Like, <laughs> well, I don't even want to see that come up on my uh, my uh, my bank statement. You know what I mean? I don't want that extra looking like that. Mm -mm. You can have the extra man. A little tip, a little, a little extra eight thousand on top of that man. You know, we can get one fifty per day, man. We ain't even tripping. You know what I'm saying? We ain't even tripping. It's just like the turtle. Yeah. And of course, nah, all, of all my friends wanted to take a picture. My bad, y'all. My bad, y'all. I was on a rant, my bad. Here. Here. Our point pool. I forgot where I was for a second. People. They're my hype crew. Like, you don't have to hang out with them to make it feel good. I will be sad if you don't sit down and relax. Okay. Yeah, yeah, like everybody sit down. Don't make them stand there. It's only been an hour, but I'll say it. This is the best island show. That'll make, that'll make it, like, weird. Why y'all watching me? Well, you don't need anything? Uh, nah, except y'all to stop. Man, man y'all take a little break. Take a four-day break. <laughs> like, man, let me fix my own food. Quit watching me. Just bring me some breakfast and some fruit throughout the day, though. <laughs> Top of all of that, the yeah, island has a house with stuff. a driving range on the roof where you can hit golf balls into the ocean. What? These are made of fish food. Oh, that's fine. <gasps> that's fine. Oh. You should probably hit it further so you don't hit someone. Right. Look at all those flamingos. There's so much I can't process it. Wow, flamingos in the sky. <sighs> they don't love us unless we give them food. All right. Uh, uh, nobody does, right? But flamingos are the only <laughs> Yeah, I mean, nobody does. Nobody loves you unless you get them food. <laughs> the animals just act just like us. I told y'all they had just like that. They like, you ain't got no food? I, ain't, I don't mess with you. They like, ugh. <laughs> animals on this island. Oh! That's a dinosaur. This is so cool. And believe it or not, this tortoise can live oh. to be over 200 years old. Wow, this tortoise, my so name is big. Jimmy. If my descendants, descendants, descendants come here, tell them I was awesome. And afterwards, that means that, that means there's no um, probably no like uh, snakes on the island. Not too many because they they eat they eat turtles, snakes and stuff like that. Especially if that turtle get that big, that means snakes can get big too on that island. But he's he's been living there so long, he was able to get so big, he's able to eat so good. That means nothing is like praying for him, you know what I mean? So he's good, like they're able to live there peacefully and just have fun with each other. Like I love it. I actually love this island, bro. This is this a this a I can't believe it's even up available for any type of purchase. I can't believe it. nobody already didn't buy it and just like you know what I mean? This, this we got sworn by a bunch of lemurs that live on Look the at them. Get over here! Jimmy, I don't know if you know. I know at night it must be crazy. You see them in the tree or something, they looking at the Yeah. They making these little noises. You like what is there's two lemurs on here. Yeah, I know. I'm trying not to move. I'll put food on there. Oh, nah, tell them you're <laughs> And if you're wondering where all of these exotic animals came from, most of them, sadly, are endangered species and are on this island because the owner of Richard Branson brought all of them here to prevent uh, them from going extinct. <gasps> That's the thing I was thinking. This dude is smart. Because I thought about that one day. Mm, and they able to live there and they survived on their own at that. Like... You see what I'm saying? Like, you don't really have to necessarily feed them. They was able to survive there. Off of just the island, off the land itself. Just like, just like, just like how they are normally doing. Just how we normally do, you know? They were smart enough to find, they, you know what I mean? What they needed to, to survive and stay, stay alive and, and you know, uh, keep, uh, to, you know, nourish themselves and procreate and stuff like that. I Man, that's pretty cool. And I was thinking that because I'm like, when I was younger, we used to see a lot of animals. Everywhere, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Everywhere, like you, you know, you see stray dogs and all that. You don't see that many animals no more. You know what I mean? Depending on where you at in the world, but I don't see many no more. I used to see. Remember once I seen a family of deer, man. It was it was like fifty of them. 
I'm talking about they was jumping over the gate, man. I seen ten of them. I'm like, oh, that's gonna be it. They still, no, they kept coming. They kept coming. We were sitting there watching them for like 20 minutes. They kept jumping over the gate and they was just following each other like a little track and uh, path. And then all of a sudden, then we started seeing the baby ones in the back. It's like all of them was just following each other. They was, I guess, they was migrating or something. It was 50 of them. It was maybe even more than that. I'm telling you, it was a lot of them, bro. They just kept coming. They look at us because we was me and my homies. We'd be out at the parks and stuff like that. And we'd be out in the woods and stuff. You know how that go. But um, they was looking at us. And then they, they, was, they just kept going about their business. They just trying to make sure we weren't trying to, you know, eat them or nothing. We ain't trying to mess with them. But now nah, we ain't trying to mess with them. We just looking and paying attention, just seeing what they was doing. I wish I could have recorded. I should have recorded it. I probably could have, but I was just so amazed. Just so amazed to see them. I'm like, bro. Like the most endangered animals on this island were the mermaids that served us sushi. <laughs> sushi. Sushi. Mermaids with sushi. That's fine. Mermaids and sushi. Mermaids and sushi. Mermaids. Do you guys want sushi? Okay, now this is looking like a siren uh, planet now. Uh, I mean, not planet, but uh, island. This is like a siren island. You know how you pass an island? And they're like, hey, come over here. They got all the food you want. They got all the... <laughs> they got the mermaids and all. <laughs> I just play, I just play, I just play. Something close, a thin line, definitely. <laughs> Look, they got all the drinks. <laughs> they importing everything. <laughs> they stealing from us. That's why we ain't got nothing. They got it all. <laughs> Let me stop. Let me stop. I mean, 150 million. They definitely can get what they want. I'm telling you that right now. <sighs> they probably gotta send it to the private island. Y'all can't have it on the main island. But you know what I mean? Oh man, they funny. Okay. My bad, y'all. I had a moment. Is that cannibalism? Yes. Ah. <laughs> Get over here. There's honestly so much on this island, we can't even film it all. Oh, my we God. Play tennis. We play basketball. Oh, my God. Man, you know, don't keep showing us this stuff, Mr. Beast. You definitely gonna have everybody trying to get to this island. I'm telling you that right now. You can play tennis and basketball. This is, I'm talking about that's for the white and the black people. That's for the black and the white people. You're dead. <laughs> we explored yet right. another mansion. Uh, I did my first cold plunge. You get the idea. There's so much to do. Oh, we got goats. Man, we got ponies, man. What? We coming to the island, man. What? Man, what? This island, it's actually overwhelming. Oh, this my. It's actually pretty intense. I'm like, actually intense. <laughs> you want to know what else is intense? What? The final island, I'll see you. Oh, there. yeah, I forgot. It's another one. Why are we still here? And on the way to the $250 oh. million oh island, my. we stopped in shark infested waters because I. <laughs> Of course. Pay for this video. <laughs> they say because I have to pay for this video. <laughs> what feels like my worst nightmare. No, no, you good. My stomach is so close. Oh my gosh. And the worst part is, I'm not coming out until I'm done with this ass. You good. They don't look aggressive at all. Uh, I promise you, those don't look aggressive at all. Actually, they look pretty. They look about your size. So they, they might be they might be more scared of you than you scared of it, to be honest. That's probably why it's multiple of them. Because sharks that's that's really aggressive, they're going to be by themselves. You know what I mean? You might see one, two of them together. It ain't going to be that many. They like eagles. You're not going to see that many together at all. You know what I mean? But the ones that's like, uh, they they unsure if they can handle the life. You're going to see you're gonna see a bunch of them. You're going to see a school of fish. You know what I mean? You, you can tell. You can always tell. That's like, it's like, it's the same as us. The people that are, that don't think they can do it, they're gonna be with, with a gang, they're gonna be with that, you know what I mean? They're gonna have it, they crew, they're gonna have it, yeah, whatever. And they look government behind them, whatever. The people that can do it on their own, they're they gonna be on their own. They're gonna solo do, they're gonna lone wolf it. It's the same as real life, they're gonna ghost it. You know what I mean? It's the same as real life. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So now I don't think them sharks are that, which is good though. It gives everybody the experience to be able to get in that water and actually, you know, uh, just test it out, you know what I'm saying? It ain't no, it ain't no whale shark, and it ain't gonna eat the whole damn cage. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> they barely could bite through that. You have to be an absolute maniac to do this. Not even stomach guys could pay me to do this. Why are you all here, sharks? Oh, oh, they're so close, they're so close. And for their new season, they went all out with new Mr. B skins, animations, and moves. It's cool though. Look, it's cool, right? Bro, this is wild. I want to make sure there's enough sharks for Jimmy. They also added a brand new level. You have to follow. Pattern as long as possible to stay alive, and the longer you live, the harder it gets. Oh, a shark hitting me? I think a shark's are hitting me. It was rocking. 
I also just released my brand new toolkit. It's the eyes for me. They literally don't blink. It's the eyes for me. They like, I see you, and I'm looking at you the whole time, and I'm not taking my eye off you. They turn around, I see you over here, I still see you. Hammerhead, shark, I ain't turning. They, hammerhead, hey, the hammerhead's got the eyes on the side, don't it? <laughs> they like, I see you from every side. <laughs> Looking all left and right, they like, I see you. <laughs> hammerhead, shark. Sure. This is far, though. All right, we're going to skip a little bit, y'all. I want to get straight into this last island for show. 250 million. Ooh, okay. All right, let's see what's on this island. $115 million island. Okay. This is a $250 million wow. private island. This extraordinary- Who cleaning up all this shit? <laughs> the ocean comes, the ocean gonna rip this junk away. Who gonna clean up all this stuff? Uh, <laughs> let me stop, okay. I mean, it is, it is uh, 80% water on the planet. I mean, I'm pretty sure eventually it's gonna do its thing. And that's crazy. They got stuff everywhere. Okay. They, they did not. They didn't leave any spot untouched. <laughs> uh, this one definitely doesn't have animals on this island. This is for the kids for sure. There's no animals on this island. I know. This is not an adventure island. This is um, play, play. This is playland. It's play island. Wow. It also has its own hot air balloon and just about. I want to go. <laughs> You can't tell us about the yacht. It also has its own hot air balloon. You ain't tell us about the yacht and then the jumbo yacht that takes two helicopters. You ain't tell us about the yachts. You get taken on a yacht there. You get to enjoy that thing for a whole month. I need a month. I don't admit a week is not nothing to say. Mama said we only going there for the weekend. The weekend, we need a whole month, a whole 30 day vacation here. This looks amazing. Just about every activity. I'm like, I wonder how much it is for a day. And we have it all to ourselves. It's called Thrill Water Park. Let me see, y'all. I'm going to find out right now. Little, little FBI, CIA agent. Let's find out right now. Go ahead. We go to uh, Google.com. We type in Thrill Water Park, and we find out the prices for this one right here. Thrill Water Park Island. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Island. Because we want the real thing. We want the real thing, not the fake one. You know what I mean? We're gonna put a uh, daily daily price. You know what I mean? We could have we could have asked the AI uh, chat because AI chat know everything. You know what I mean? We could ask the but but that's cool. Hey, it said this island. Hey, it said ranges between fifty to a hundred dollars per person per day. So I'm I'm guessing everything. That's just to get in. But I'm guessing after that, of course, you probably gotta pay for the other stuff. But that's not that bad. So it says, no, 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 all right, let me change that. It says between, a better price here, it says between, Thrill Water Park is between $93 and $200 per person. Ex extra charge venues and activities, which which we understand that. But as far as just the price just to get there to the island and everything like that, isn't too bad. That isn't too bad. Compared to what he was talking about the other island, um, $142,000. Like, what? This one, do we gonna pay two hundred and then we gonna keep the other hundred and forty thousand? We gonna put two thousand on the activities and things like that. You see what I'm saying? Like, it's only a no-brainer at this point, right? That's pretty cool, though. It's pretty cool, man. We gonna spend Mr. Beast money, though. Let's spend Mr. Beast money. This one stands above the rest. In the middle of the it's island amazing, is though. a massive water slide. Even though literal eight-year-olds ride that water slide, I might still check it out because I'm afraid of heights. But before taking on the water slide, we checked out the other features, like how there's over a hundred jet skis on this island. Shoot. It's a bit overkill. And not to mention, there's a literal zip line that spans across ah. man-made beaches. Oh, What's that's fire. What am I gonna hit? The ground, bro. Because sometimes people fall off. <laughs> this is like really scary. That's yes, what I was thinking. I'm like, what if somebody really drops? Is there a net under the whole thing? Or what's going on with that? <laughs> hey, man. There you go. Oh, they, they got they got a uh, rope and stuff like that. So if you if you let go, you ain't gonna fall. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. You're going over the, almost um, the whole park. This is actually not that crazy. And if you only if people was there, it would be they'll be screaming up, Mister Beast, yeah. You know what I mean? Hey, where's all the people? You showing us the island, but where is the people? You don't rent the damn island. You don't rent the island out, y'all. Nah, just playing. It's probably just not in season right now. Nah, that don't even make sense. It's a, it's a private island, right? And they there now. They enjoying the weather, right? It don't look cold there right now. So that don't make sense. They, they either rented it out or people not visiting these places. 
and that that's kind of insane. I mean, it's not Disney World, so it's not really promoted. We don't. Know, I didn't know nothing about it until he just showed us, right? But again, like I always tell people, with things that's out of your tax bracket, you ain't gonna know nothing about it until a rich person show you. You see what I'm saying? A billionaire have to show us this. We would know nothing about Thrill Island. We just keep going to Disney World, right? Exactly. <laughs> you know, I mean, different tax brackets, different tax brackets for sure. This island, you can host over 13,000 of your friends at any of these five gargantuan pools. Oh, Man, I get lost looks on that like island, it was made bro. in Minecraft, and it's so funny just seeing my two friends in it. Nolan looks like a tiny speck. For $250 million, this island, of course, has exotic animals. Is that a peacock? Wait, do you have animals? I need to take you in for questioning, sir. <laughs> All right, you better leave that peacock alone. Any game you can imagine. Ooh. I wish there was the 13,000 people that are normally here to watch how bad he is at Cornwall. Is that oh, 13,000 people? Island okay. Things I didn't even know existed. But something I noticed is that there were way too many lifeguards at this island for just the four of us. How many lifeguards are on this island? Oh, over 100. Really? With this many lifeguards, okay. you would have to try to drown. So I thought <laughs> it would be fun if we gave them all the day off. Has anyone ever rented this island before? Well, this is I knew they rented it. I was like, that's the only way you can get the island to be private like that. 13,000 people, they couldn't come because they can't even rent the island out. Okay. First, dude, you are leaning back. You look oh, way too yeah. relaxed. And after all the 100 <laughs> cars went down, they decided to hype up me and the boys for our turn to go down the slide. <laughs> <laughs> boys, you want to know what's even scarier than that? What? That one. That, that so one. Terrifying. <laughs> that looks so scary. We can skip it. Towering at over 135 feet tall, this is the tallest water slide in all of North America. I don't it's even a tool. know what I'm looking at. <laughs> it's like a sky. It's not even I'm open. <laughs> Daredevil's Peak. What a soothing name. Very inviting. Oh, we're so high. It's kind of freaking me out. I was... It's not that bad. You're going around in a circle in a tube. That ain't that bad. You ever been on them slides that go like this and then drop straight down? And then you feel like you fit, you pull it off of the thing. You Half the time, you fall off of the thing. And then when you come down, it swoop like that. And then your body catch it again. Man, that, that one just going in a circle. Or maybe one of the ones that go around and then it don't have a tube. It literally, you start sliding off the side. And then it come back down and bring it back. That's more scary than that. That's just a tube tall in the air. That's not even a six. Six flags got scarier rise than that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what? Talking about right now, boy. Made it to the top. Like, literally, that's a tube. It's just dark. Look how intense the wind is up here. Oh, don't look down. Look how crazy the island is. Let me see. Oh, my God. Carl. This is just a tube. Oh, no, that can't be that bad. Did you say no scopes is enforceable? No scopes is enforceable. There we go. <laughs> Alright, go, go, go ahead, bro. You got it, bro. You got this. See, it's just going to start laying the bed, bro. You got this, bro. You got this. Okay. Oh, God. Why is it so fast? Yeah, it's fast. I can see that, though. Woo! I'm gonna do this for entertainment, even though giant rides scare me. Okay, go, Mr. Beast, go. Go for us. I was basically just drowning the entire time down. You get drowned out. The water side. I gotta say, this whole island was pretty awesome. <laughs> Hey, and one more thing, make sure you use this QR code to <laughs> He would get smashed in the face the whole time. Uh, she said she had that water part and you didn't believe her. <laughs> See y'all in the next one, man. We out. Peace.